So we're going to be crossing over to the other section. So we're going past the mini golf. It's a well-kept mini golf. It's cute. So this is the main road that we we're talking about. And it isn't just a campground road, it is a main road. So there's cars that come through here all day long. So if you're crossing over from side to side with a golf cart or with the kids, you're gonna to wanna to be careful, especially with the little hill there. As you can see, they come right over. So in this section here, there's a little arcade in the front. They have a little carousel, which is part of their activities. You can have free carousel rides today for the kids. So now in this section are the north sites, the west sites, north cabins, ball field, courts, pool, and stage. There's the dog park on the left. If you have a larger breed dog, you'll be good to let the dog off their leash in there. We have a small breed dog and there was quite a few spots where we noticed he could easily get out, like a one foot section, he could sneak out. So we kept him on a leash while we were in there. Site 300, 302. So in this area, they have a volleyball net. They have a very nice wooden playground looks fairly new too. The kids would probably really like that if you have younger kids. There's some open sites right here. Looks like it might be patio sites because it has the swings. They have a gazebo, basketball hoop over there. There's a ball field. They have a wiffle ball game going on today. So even during the week, there's scheduled activities going on, which is really nice. Some campgrounds don't do that during the week. So ages five to 12 on the playground, it says. For their scheduled activities, they also do timed activities. So their jump pad, they can um, section off a time of day just for six and under, just for 10 and over. So here's the patio sites. And then all the way around, you can see. So 208, 210. You can see there's sites that go all the way around. So 203 is on the end and then going all the way up. So if you're looking at the map, uh, you'll know which ones they are. So 205. So pretty spaced out. You can have more grass here. Some sites have grass, some sites have the mica gravel. Some have more of like a dirt base. So if you care about what kind of site you have, I would ask when you book your site. 213, 215. So it looks like a lot of these might be the seasonals. Going all the way up. A lot of them are pretty developed. 